Calvary Grog has a long tradition of identifying true Calvarymen. The punch's ferocity and keen taste can be savored by those old Calvary troopers who spurred their way to victory. A brew that will cure what ails you or make you just not care. Calvary legend has it that during the years of the westward expansion in the mid-1800s, troopers would share their spirits and liquors with one another at night around their campfires. The alcoholic mix usually, usually consisted of whatever an individual's taste was, and when mixed in a pot with other troopers' ingredients, it would create a powerful drink known as a grog. Today's grog ceremony is a symbolic reflection of this age-old tradition and a ceremonial mixing serves to bring the past and present together. Any tankers in the house? Oh. Any tankers in the house? Oh. Thank God for armor in the streets of Baghdad. In recognition of all our tankers, their bravery and their courage years past and in years future, we had this Kentucky bourbon. At our very beginning, Colonial Cavalry raided Redcoat and Hessian supply lines. Their favorite prize? German beer. <laughs> to honor the tradition, dedication, and elan of our cavalry troopers, I add this fine German brew. Ooh. To represent the troopers past and present and all the great things that the Dragoons have done, Dragoons for Life is our motto and it's, it's there and we believe it. Dragoon for Life, for all who are here who can say that. For all Black Horse Troopers, Black Horse Forever, Alonis! Alonis! And if I had a saber, I would have chopped it up. <laughs>